Hi there, it's Mark Sebastian, founder of Option Pit, and this is the Vol Report reminder. This is for education purpose only. Should we consider investment advice options to have risk? Consult a financial professional if you have questions. So, hey, yesterday I did a webinar with Stephen Place on BXX and, uh, you know, how to trade it, some trends. It was really pretty good. Uh, we were calling it the easiest short if you don't blow up. So it's, um, and it, you can do that and you can buy our kind of combined pack for uh, on the page optionpit.com slash VXX pack. Speaking of which, how about VXX today? Um, it is up after really being pretty soft yesterday. We've got another day where vol is up, markets are down, but really um, we're not kind of breaking out of any range. Right, take a look at SPX here. All right, it's just keeps hovering around this 50 day moving average. Oop, that's not what I wanted to do. You know, it keeps hovering above the 200, but it's not making a run toward. The 50 day, basically the high from kind of yesterday looks like a, uh, a little little area for markets to bounce. To, it just kind of wants to sit there. You know, we are heading into expiration. That could be an effect on things. But it, it seems pretty range bound, but there is a little bit involved. Um, yesterday's uh, Fed didn't make markets feel a lot better. And you can see bonds are starting to soften again. So people are a little worried, and you can see there's a bid for vol and VIX. VIX is uh, 1880. Um, so we are back to being slightly backward. I would just say mostly flat is the market, but the S&P does look soft today. So you, you got to wonder, well, where, where are we heading to? Where are we off to? And right now, it appears we're going a whole lot of nowhere. But, again, look at VXX. It's right near, you know, it's way off the high highs. But, you know, it's looking a little stronger. It'll be interesting to see where it, where it goes today and tomorrow. So, you know, some what am I watching? Well, we had some earnings. Um, Alcoa had great earnings yesterday. It's up huge. Um, but like, you know, Constellation Brands, they had their um, CEO quit, although really had did not make the move that it, it was planning. There was a bunch of earnings, uh, you know, in and around this morning and coming up uh, between the banks and, and different names like that. Um, you know, one name that I am watching is NVIDIA, which was added to Goldman's conviction buy list. And is a name that I think, look, you know, this is an opportunity to buy. It's going to break, I think, it's going to break over that 200. And I'm going to be looking at a trade in that today. Uh, I continue to have trades that I'm following in like Square and Microsoft and a few other names uh, that I, I think are interesting. And I'm going to look at the indexes and ETFs to kind of come up with some different ideas. Uh, all right, folks, if you have questions, you can email me marketoption.com or call me 888-TRADE01. Have a good one.